So in this lesson, we want to find the vector given. So we want to find the vector given that we have the uh, x living in the uh, the non-standard basis of b provided by uh, b1 and b2, and we want to see we want to convert that in back into the standard into the standard basis. Okay. All right. So we have. All right, so again, our basis vectors consist of b1 and b2, and we have the coordinate vector in terms of our basis vectors, 3, 2. So all we have to do for this is just to form the linear combination of xb in terms of b1 and in terms of b1 and b2. Okay, so the vector x, okay, okay, so that is, so this vector x is going to be. Uh, we're going to form the linear combination of b1 and b2, where the weights are coming from uh, the vector of x in terms of beta. So this will be 3 okay, times beta 1 plus 2 times beta 2. Okay, So we're going to get times b1 plus 2 times minus 1, 1. Okay, and that's going to give us, okay, so this will give us 6, 3 and minus 2, 2. Okay, so this gives us 4, 4, 5, and that's the vector that we started out with in the last uh, in the previous video okay so all right so the vector x in terms of the basis vectors is equivalent to 4 5 in terms of the standard basis in terms of the in terms of the yeah the, the, the standard basis vectors okay so uh, so yeah that's that's how you that's how we do this okay so we, but we have to be given the basis vectors um, in order to get back to the other, to the original space, okay?